This is the harsh reality of doing your first pass paper for your biology A-levels. So you go into the first pass paper and you think you're ready, you've memorized your notes, you've highlighted everything, you've got everything ready to go. Then the paper lands in front of you and all of a sudden you don't recognize half the questions, your brain's dying to stall, you're forgetting key words that you thought you knew, you're looking at data and graphs, you have no idea what to do with them, and you can feel those marks starting to slip away. Now this can be the harsh reality of doing a pass paper for the first time. But before we go any deeper, if you do like getting hints and tips to help you reach an A star in biology, then please make sure you follow along to the channel. Now the thing is, even if you do fail your first pass paper, while this isn't ideal, you need to try and think of it as data collection. So you're able to take this paper, you can take your feedback and you can see exactly where it is you went wrong, where your weak spots are, what you can fix, and most importantly, it's gonna show you exactly what the examiners are expecting of you. The panic and anxiety they might have felt going into the test and during the test is normal, a lot of students are gonna feel that way, but what you need to make sure you do now is you need to take that and you need to take the data and improve. So you need to go find your support, go look through the mark schemes, just don't get too downhearted if the first paper was a bit more stressful than you'd anticipated. Remember that this is all part of a process, you're just beginning that process, and if you follow the steps you will become more comfortable and you will start to see your results improving.